Hello everyone and welcome to your channel Techwine. In this video, I will provide you the easiest method through which you can solve this lab. First of all, start your lab. And now we will open our Google Cloud Console and we have to use the username 1. So copy this name. Now open your Cloud Console. Click Next. And then for the password, copy this password and simply enter it click I understand agree and continue and now we are in our cloud console now you have to open this cloud shell click continue Now let's go back to the lab and move to the first task. For the first task, we have to create a bucket called this. Now what you have to do, you have to go to the description. In the description, you will find a link of my repository and from this repo, you can copy this command. Now go back to your cloud shell, paste it and for the bucket name, we have to use this name, so copy it. Again go back to the cloud shell and simply paste it then hit enter click authorize this command will create a bucket for you now you can check the progress for first task for the second task we have to create a pubsub topic again go back to my repository copy this command and paste it in the cloud shell and for the name we will use this name, so copy it. After pasting the name, hit enter. Ok, now you can check the progress for second task. For the third task, copy this name. And in the search bar of cloud console, search for cloud functions. Open this. Now create a function and for the function name simply paste the copied text then scroll down and for the trigger type select cloud storage then for the event type select this one and for the bucket click on this browse now select this bucket this is the bucket which we have created in the task 1 click select then simply click on this save click next now go back to the lab and you can see we have to use the node.js 14th version so you can select this from here and then for the entry point copy this and simply paste it now copy this com now copy this file again you have to go back to the lab now copy the content of this index.js and first of all remove everything from here and paste the content then move to this file and again copy the content for this file and then simply add the content now you can click on this deploy this deployment will take some time so you have to wait for 5 minutes once it is complete go back to your bucket go to cloud storage then to buckets now you have to open the bucket which we have created in first task now we will upload a file in this bucket so go back to the lab and copy this link and open this link in your browser. Now save this image. Now go back to your bucket and we will upload this file. Click on this upload then click on this open. Now our file is uploaded. 
now what you have to do you have to click on this refresh again click on refresh now go back to the lab and check the progress for third task and for this task we have to remove the access from this user so go back to your cloud console and go to this im now scroll down and you will find two users and we have to remove the access from second user so how we can find the second user go back to the lab and copy this username to and paste it somewhere and now you can see this user is ending with 14 so this is my second username click on this edit icon now click on this delete then click save now go back to the lab and check the progress for this task congratulations you have successfully completed this lab and if the video was helpful please consider subscribing for the next time stay safe stay healthy